guys, Cindy Otter here with my Artsy Endeavors. How are you doing today? I'm doing fantastic. Guess what we're going to work on? We are going to work on My Giant Life. Now, you'll notice this year um, that I'm doing My Giant Life on a much smaller card. And the reason I'm doing that, not because I still have the big cards, but this is, oh, let me bring you out. This is my My Creative Year binder, and this card fits perfectly in that pocket. So that's why I'm doing them on these cards this year, because I'm trying to get everything down into one journal. We'll see how well that goes. All right, so to start the year off, let me just grab my prompt here. Now I'm joining Anne um, Williamson, Gina Ahrens, and Irene... Eileen, I'm sorry, let me think. <laughs> um, ah, I don't have her name. Um, I will see if I can find that and put it up on a text. Uh, so anyways, this is for My Giant Life. This is January 2018. And the very first prompt is My Giant Vision. What are you waiting for? Create a vision board of something you have been wanting to do. It could be a goal you want to achieve, a new art technique. Make it with steps of how you want to achieve that goal. All right, well, my goal or achievement, I'm not sure, I think this is still wet. I was doing another project. Um, this year is my husband um, has retired. So, my, our goal, I'm just kind of looking over here for my collage stuff. Um, let me just grab a handful of it and see what I've got. There's a little bit of book text. Um, one of our goals this year is to sell our house here in New York and move down south. Ooh, look at that map. Perfect. What else is in here? Um... So that's one of our goals. We are working on it. That looks like a good piece to put on there. Oh, I like this. And I like this. Okay, good enough. We have more than enough. Okay, I can make six cards out of what I got sitting here. So let's start out. Let's get this glued down. And I'm going to use my matte medium. Maybe. And let's get this card started. Now I realize I have a non-stick mat here, but my non-stick mat is getting really old and it's, um, it, the stuff doesn't come off it as easy. So that's why um, I'm using wax paper underneath it too. All right, so a new house, new beginnings, new exciting things. Oh, I just can't wait. Um, we are both just, you know, we've lived in New York all our lives. Um, you know, it, it gets old. <laughs> you know, some people, oh, I gotta see all four seasons. I don't want to live in air conditioning. You know, I don't mind the four seasons. I don't like the fact that three of the seasons are just here and gone. And the one I really don't like lasts forever, which is winter. So, yeah. I've had enough. I'm ready for it to be decent and warm and I just, I need something different. And we're also hoping too that um, by getting me out of this, um, out of the cold and stuff, that possibly my fibromyalgia and my back pain will kind of, you know, chill out a little bit. I mean, we don't know, but we're going to try and see and hope and pray and because you know it gets, it gets really old the pain gets old too so so we are making steps to you know we're getting stuff done here around the house that needs to be done before we can put the house on the market and um you know hubs is enjoying his retirement which is phenomenal. I mean, we just uh, couldn't count down the days fast enough. He started at like 187 or something like that. 
<laughs> it was like, oh, when is it ever going to get here? <laughs> so, and, you know, it's wonderful because we really enjoy spending time together. And we just, you know, it's, it's so much fun having him home. And, you know, I'm not alone all day every day. And, you know, I enjoy it. I think it's fantastic. So... Some people, you know, I've heard people say, oh, I can't stand my husband being home all the time. Well, you know what? I enjoy my husband being home because we just, we have a lot of fun together. So, all right. So we've got this all collaged down. Now I'm going to dry it up and then I'm going to cut around the edges. Oh, I see a little piece right here we need to fix. Oh, well, let's use this. This is kind of cool. I don't know. Christy Tomlinson maybe is where I got this. Um, she used to have a shop um, doing mixed media stuff, and then she just went all planner society. But um, I love this. It was it's like a tissue paper. It's got a tissue paper feel to it. Let me bring you guys in. Maybe you can see a little bit more. So I really like this. Let me just throw another piece on here. Oh, why not? Mm -hmm. All right. You can hear my ice machine running next to me. It's quiet in here today. Okay. See, I had enough scraps, right? All right, let's dry it up and cut it out, and let's get moving on our house. I'll be right back. Okay, so it's pretty well dry, and I trimmed it back down so it's the size of a card, of the card, I should say. And this is just a little book here that I use to swap paint in. And I use <laughs> two funky drawings. So um, I've got out some, these are just craft paints here. I've got Apple Barrel Regency Blue, which we're just going to put that right up here. And then I have um, Deco Art Wild Green. Of course we know it's going to go down here. And then I have Tropical Blue by DecoArt. So let's just put little drops of that here. Alright, and let's play. So we got our... So talking about our new house, um, what are the steps? <laughs> you guys know, anybody that's bought a house, you know what the steps are. Um, you know, we've got to get this one ready to sell. We've got to get the finances to buy the other one together. And, you know, find that dream home. And um, that's what we have to do. And we can do it. Because I'm really excited about it. All right, I'm just going to keep with the blue. And just take the green down here. Love it already. Love it! Okay, the green, I'm going to have to grab another one and go back into that blue. I love these. These are just little makeup wedges I get. Um, there's a store here in New York called um, the Christmas Tree Shop. And that's where I find these. And it's like $5 for a bag of them, but they last forever. And I just, I love the way they handle. They have a nice wide base. But then again, if you needed to, you can do real small, intricate details. Um, my husband loves them for that. Actually, I want a little bit more of a green. Let's see. I shouldn't do that to my hand. This is Deco Art Holiday Green. Just want a little bit darker green on that. Whoops, this one's a green one. Yeah. All right, so let's dry this up real quick. Now, I'm um, just going to hit this with a heat gun. I went into my scraps, and this is just a whole bunch of scrapbook scrapbook paper, um, scraps that I found. So I want to build a house out of these. Oh, there's a die cut. It doesn't belong in there. Um, I'm going to build a house. Look at that. I'm going to build a house. I think I'm going to use this. Um, let's see what else we got. Oh, this is cool. Guess what trees are going to be? Uh, oh, this is pretty. That's very pretty. Well, let's see what else we have. We've got some arrows. Love it. Blanks. Blanks. Some golf tees. Okay, that's pretty well dry. 
Um, we're just gonna we're just gonna play. Ooh, I like that color too. All right, so let's start out with. I like this. Let's let's make a house, shall we? <coughs> Pardon me. <coughs> My house is not going to be this tall. Definitely not. But let's do it right there. Ah, it looks cockeyed, doesn't it? I love wonky houses. It's so funny because I was actually talking with um, Jeff about that, and I'm going to move it up a little bit right there. Let's see. Um, what I love about some of the houses that I'm seeing down there, um, the ones that are just the brand new construction, all pretty, pretty, yada, yada, that's way too big, huh? Um, they're okay, but to me, they don't have character. I want character in my house. I want it to have a personality. It can't just be a square box, you know? But anyways, that's me. I don't care if it goes over the edge. That'll work. So I want my house to have character. So this house is going to have character. That's just the way it shall be. Now, my little stars here. We're going to make this into a little walkway, maybe. I will just put that down there at the bottom of the house. All right, let's see. Arrows. I like the arrows. Which yellow. So I'll make my windows. They don't, do they need to be square? No, nah, we're going to change them. They're not going to stay square, I can tell you that. We're going to make a door. But I want it to go. There's my door. It says go away. Sorry, that was just kind of funny. <laughs> Here's a window. I don't like that one. There's another window. Um, there's another window. Doop. Doop. Another window. Why not? I think cool. Maybe I'll do them like that. I gotta fix that. I don't like that doorway. Let's do a different doorway. Um, let's do it pointing up. Let's see if this looks better. Yep. All right, so there's my house. There's my doorways. There's my windows. All right, where's this piece of paper? This is gonna be some trees. This, I think, came out of a Flow magazine. Yep, that's going to be cut out to be a tree. There's another tree. I need to get my little scissors out for that. It's so exciting, isn't it? I know a few of our um, other people, Anne, has actually moved recently. Which, oh gosh, I know her stress, so I can just imagine, you know. <sighs> but we'll get it done. Um, you know, my husband is a, you know, I've got to do it all by myself type of person. So, um, we'll get it done. I hear a car running. And I don't think there's anybody around my house, so I'm not sure what I'm hearing. It's getting dark outside. I've got um, my essential oils diffusing, and today I'm smelling spearmint and sweet orange. Mm -mm, what a combination. I like them. All right, so my giant life has got some giant plants next to my house. All right, let's get some gluing down on this. And... We'll keep at it. So let's glue our house. We're going to use a glue stick, plain old glue stick, just because we can. Like I said, my house is wonky. It's not straight. It's not even. It's not square. It's not a box, and I don't want it to be. So we're going to put that right there in the middle. Clean up. Ouch. Clean up my 
Oh, hang on, got a problem with the wrist. Oh. Um. All right, let's see. I don't want this to be like that. So we're gonna make it like that. Yay, much better. I got something going on with that wrist. It's like stuck. Sorry guys. <laughs> there we go. I just snapped it. All right, so here's our tree. Look at that little roof. <laughs> Love it! My little star. I don't know why I have to put that there, but it's going to be there. And you know, we've already decided when we move, this is it. It's it. We're done. We are not... This is the... Right now, this is the house we're in. Um, this is the third house we have purchased um, from becoming... Once since we got married. And we're tired. <laughs> I'm tired. Tired of moving. So we're going where it's warm and I'm just beyond excited and I cannot wait to, you know, maybe get rid of some of this pain. I can only hope, you know, so. Doo -doo -doo. I like those little arrows. And of course I'll have to get my pens and stuff out and doodle and that kind of stuff. But for right now we're going to put it together. Perfect. Okay. Now we're going to put on. Oh, you know what? We might have to use some of this. I like this. We might have to make that into the sun or something. So we're going to put on our trees. These, like I said, these came out of a flow. This is a page out of a flow magazine. Might have been the flow for paper lovers. I'm not sure. But it's definitely out of a flow magazine. It just has that feel to it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Our little wonky house. It's perfect. All right, I want to make a sun. This looks like a cool sun, doesn't it? Let's make that into a sun. Why not? So let's just, yeah, I do hear a vehicle running, which is kind of strange. So I'm going to have to go look at that. But this is going to be our sun. Ta-da! Because we're going where it's sunny. Yay! I don't like that black thing there, the green thing there. So let's get rid of that. There's our sun. Ta da! <laughs> That's pretty. Alright, so let's cut it off. Yay! Our sun. All right, I need to go check and see what that noise is because I don't know what it is. And I will be right back and we're gonna finish up our little wonky house. Okay, so I'm back. Um, yeah, that noise is still going on outside. I don't know what it is. I've looked all around my property and I couldn't find it. So I don't know where it is. And then it took me a second to come back on because um, I decided I had to eat some of these. <laughs> they're Glen D and they're coconut chips. And what I love about them, they're little chip snacks. Aren't they cool? They're just slices of coconut. But the ingredients are coconut, cane sugar, honey, and salt. And that's it. I love these things. So, I was actually plant eating some of those while I'm sitting there hanging out. Um... I want to do some doodling on here. Oops. Get some pens out. Don't drop them in my water. I've done that before. These are the graphics liners. And these are really cool. They're graphics line painters. And they're just like a really, really fine um, nib. See them? Yeah. 
I just want to put more some more yellow into our sun. Oops. And you have to be careful because if you push them too much, the paint will come out this part instead of on the nib. And I've done that lots of times before. So, so we're just going to, we're doodling. So we're talking about our new home. As of right now, we have not found it yet. Um, we will. We're so excited. Okay, here's my yellow. Look at this gold. We're going to put gold on our windows because it's going to be our forever home. You know, it's so, you know, it's so it's exciting to move, but it's also very stressful as well as um, a lot of work. There's me looking out. Hi. Saying hi to everybody. This is my black. So you guys all know the, you know, the, ooh, that's really black. Um, the gist of it. We have to buy a new place. We get all our crap together and packed up in boxes and downsize. And, you know, I have a huge art room here. It's going to take some time to get this all packed up. But I, uh, to be fair about it, it's all not going. I will be um, getting rid of some stuff. So, and that's all good with me. I really should go through and do all the background on those trees, but I'm not gonna. I'll tell you why. I'm gonna put more color in those trees. Let's use some pink and yellow and purple. Gotta use purple. I don't think it shook that one. Let's try pink. We're gonna do this. Why not? We can do this. This is our house, right? I love my house. Do, do, do. It's so fun having wanky houses. Wonk, wanky houses? Wonky houses? Funky houses? Oh, this one I don't think is working. See, I don't hear the thing in it. Let's see. Little tiny ones. Hmm. That's all right. Little berries, maybe. We have pink blooms and tiny purple berries. We make this stuff up as we go along, don't we? <laughs> Why not? All right. Um, I'm actually just playing with some pens now. I just I'm just playing with some pens. All right. Let's give them some blue. Yeah. Just because we can. I'm just sitting here while I'm doing this. I'm thinking, happy, happy tree and a happy, happy bush in a wonky, wonky house. <laughs> I know I'm crazy. You guys think I'm crazy. It's all good. So we're just playing. Playing with our house. Making it our own. Having fun with it. Let's see. Let's put a bird Doot, doot. There's a birdie. Doot, doot. Doot, doot. Why not? I wonder if they should be black. I don't like them black. Let's do them white. You're like, yeah, right. How are you going to do that? With white paint. We're just going to go like this. Ha ha. How's that? We're making them white. It's all good. Look at that. Now. I love doing these kinds of videos because 
I get a chance to play, yet I also get a chance to give you guys a video, which, you know, I enjoy doing this. So, what else do I need on here? What do you think? Let me see if this will... No, that one's not writing like I want it to. Um, Uniball. Uniball. Where's my Uniball Signo? Right here. Show this one. I'm just going to put the udders. New. Home. In. The. South. There she be. I love it. So here is my um, my giant life for January. And again, this is what are you waiting for? Create a vision board. Well, I didn't create a vision board. I created a vision. And this is the vision of my home down south eventually. I'm really, really excited. Um, we both are to go on this adventure and to find our forever home and we just we're really really we can't wait so I'm glad I got to share a little bit of it with you now what I'm gonna do is I'm actually gonna write on the back of it what it is and the prompt and then now there's a little wonky house um, it's gonna go right here in my folder how cool is that all right so I hope you definitely check out the other artists, and I will put Eileen's name. I can't think of her last name. It's on the tip of my tongue, but I can't think of it. But I will put it in the video description. So, so check in the description box below because um, the description box has the links to the other girls that are doing this. So definitely check it out and um, check out Ann, Annalise's and Ann Williamson. Annalise, Annalise Creations. Definitely check out her channel. This is her baby. And I hope you guys have enjoyed this. As always, like, comment, share, subscribe, thumbs up. And uh, I hope you guys have fun. That's what life's all about. Happy creating and I'll talk to you soon. Bye.